FB tweet. Pinterest email send text message print. August Brooks Bank is getting into the Jubilee spirit with his first ever royal appearance. Queen Elizabeth's great grandson, one, made his royal debut alongside parents Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooks Bank at the Platinum Jubilee pageant in London on Sunday. Dressed in a blue sweater with a Union Jack motif, the tiny royal happily bounced on his mom's knee as the varied procession of musicians, dancers, acrobats and carnival floats passed by the royal box outside Buckingham Palace. Eugenie and Jack welcomed their first child in February 2021. He is the ninth great-grandchild for the Queen and Prince Philip, and the first grandchild for Eugenie's parents. Although Princess Eugenie has shared a number of photos of August on Instagram, she has been careful not to show his face. Eugenie's sister, Princess Beatrice, and Beatrice's husband, Eduardo Mopelli Mozzi, brought Mopelli Mozzi's son from a previous relationship to enjoy the festivities. Christopher Wolfe, known as Wolfie, stepped out for his first royal event. The couple left their daughter, eight-month-old Sienna Elizabeth, at home. Beatrice and Eduardo's July 2020 wedding where Wolfie had the important role of page boy, marked the first time since Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall married Prince Charles in 2005 that a member of the British royal family stepped into the position of stepmother. Beatrice is the first of her generation, and first grandchild of the monarch, to do so. Beatrice is a wonderful and very hands-on stepmom, a source previously told People. On Thursday, August enjoyed his first trooping the color, watching the fly passed by the Royal Air Force in the arms of Jack. Prince George, 8, Princess Charlotte, 7, and Prince Louis, 4, also got into the carnival spirit on Sunday, with the parade led by the Gold State Carriage featuring a video image of the Queen waving to the crowds on her coronation day in 1953. Mia, 8, and Lena Tyndall, 3, the daughters of Zara Tyndall, Princess Anne's daughter, also enjoyed the spectacle of 10,000 performers celebrating on the streets of London drawn from across the UK and Commonwealth and comprised of volunteers, performers, key workers and figures from music, film, sports and the arts, 